Hello guys, welcome to the second part of my series called Inside Python. So in the first part we saw what are PYC files and how they are created automatically by the Python interpreter when we try to import some module into another module. So what happens is that a PYC file of the imported module gets generated in a folder called PyCache inside your project folder, right? So that is what happens um, by default. But what if I want to create the PYC file of any Python script manually then what can I do in that case so let's take an example of a Python script called test.py so it has pretty simple code in it and I want to convert it into a PYC file or I want to get a PYC version of this file right so what can I do is um, simply open the terminal and move to desktop because my test.py file is contained inside the desktop and then open the python interactive shell there and import pycompile so pycompile is a built-in python module which is used for compiling python scripts so all you have to do is pycompile.compile and then simply pass the name of the python script which you want to compile that's it and in the output I got the name of the PYC file which just got created right so here it is in the the pycache folder has got created and let's inside it so here it is test.cpython-36.pyc right so this is the python uh, compiled python file which got generated for um, the python script test.py so this is how you generate PYC files manually and I hope it is clear that's it from this video thanks for watching